night, I did not know what to wear, obviously. I, I never know what to wear. I got an obscene phone call. The guy was like, what are you wearing? What are you wearing? I'm like, I can't decide. <laughs> he got off. I, I, uh, I didn't even know what to wear to my wedding. I mean, I wore a white dress, but I didn't know if I should wear white to my wedding because I've always been kind of a sloppy eater. <laughs> I'm a little nervous because I haven't performed in a while because um, I took last year off uh, to have a baby. Um, that didn't happen. I, uh, I did get a tattoo though. Uh, it's over my ovary. It's an expiration date. And I did get married to a wonderful man named Jeffrey, and he has a five-year-old mentality. And that... <laughs> I met Jeffrey online yeah, at the supermarket, and he was <laughs> totally checking me out. And uh, then he bagged me. And, and then, uh, then we walked down the aisle. But he was so romantic when he proposed to me. Okay. <clears throat> He turned off the TV. <laughs> well, muted it. And, and that... <laughs> during a commercial. But the point is, it was my first engagement ring. And my last boyfriend had given me a piece of coal. And he told me he would marry me when it turned into a diamond from all the pressure. Uh, Life. Like, I thought I was going to be an old maid, but now I'm married, so now I'm a maid. Uh, I am 44. Yeah, I am past my sexual peak and my credit limit, and I, um, I can't have kids. It's in my lease, but um, Jeffrey does have two little boys from a previous poker game, and they are... They are the loves of my life. They are uh, 10 and 14, I think, and, and they uh, are really communicating now. They just started saying to me things like, um, I don't have to listen to you. You're not my mother. <laughs> you know, like Jeffrey says to me. Um, but I walk a very fine line with my stepsons between trying to discipline them and asking them for money. And because raising kids is expensive, right? Yeah, I mean, health care alone is outrageous. My HMO, they charge me for a self-breast exam. <laughs> it's a flat fee, but I... I uh... <laughs> Jeffrey has been begging me to bring another woman home. Yeah, <laughs> not for sex, for cooking. <laughs> Probably for sex, too, but I don't even like three-way calling. Uh, actually, my friend Shelly, she likes getting spanked during sex, yeah? I'm like, personally, I, I prefer a time out. <laughs> actually, at 44, I would rather get a massage than have sex, right? Because you can't give yourself a massage.